It's the weekend. Just finished packing. I'm trying to keep it light. Head out east for the weekend. Got a little surprise for this one, which she's about to find out. I'm pretty excited about it too. Supposed to be getting a call any minute, and uh, we'll see where that takes us. Stay tuned. What do you think about this, Hans? Outrageous. <laughs> Literally outrageous. Yeah. There we go. There's, there's our bags. Here's the trunk. Uh, first impressions? This car is insane. <laughs> it's really nuts. Our packing is a little tight. I had yeah. to put like an avocado here. <laughs> Just random. But we're on the move. And this car is nothing short of a dream to drive with a boatload of power. Can't even describe it. Locked in our seats. Alright, I gotta sign off for a bit. Going to the Hamptons for the weekend, haven't been out in a while, and this is just some icing on the goddamn cake. It has so much power. I don't even know how much horsepower it has. I'm not a car guy like that. I just love driving cars, and this thing is a monster. Literally floored into the back of my chair every time, and I can't get enough of it. You turn it out of this mode, strata into sport, The exhaust revs up like two times into Corsa, which is coarse. Goes up three times all at the touch of a button, right at your fingertips. It is nuts, if I say so myself. If I do say so myself. That's right. All right. Uh, we're taking a little break here. It's a tight ride in there. My back after a workout yesterday has seen better days. Damn, that shit is crazy. I can't believe we just did like 110. <laughs> it was insane. Don't tell anybody. All right, back to it. I'm not sure if the police like us or not. Mm, probably. Seem to be around. <laughs> yeah. Favorite first stop, Stewart's. Picked up a little bottle of wine here. Let's see what Hannah's up to in here, though. What's going on? Oh my god, can I eat that right now? Yeah, here. So hungry. Got some coffees. We actually got coconut milk lattes. Coconut milk latte. Now we have to go get laundry detergent. Because mm -hmm. this is what people do with Lamborghinis. They we're do real, real, we're real, people real regular things. Look, there's us later tonight. <gasps> See? What do you think? No, Trey. <laughs> you look so happy. Crib. So excited to get back there. What are we in the market for? I don't know. Fairy tale eggplants. Whatever those are. White cheddar, purely sea salt, or sweet and salt. Mmm. White cheddar. Mm. 
Cooking some salmon. Mm -hmm. We're sous viding. Sous viding. We've never sous vided before. Okay, now we salt each side. I don't know if you guys know what's up with this, but we don't really. Time number one. Salt each side. Generously salt each side. Day started here, just picked up Hannah from Tracy Anderson. Just walking up to my hot husband in his fucking Lambo. Yeah, that's right. You heard it. This thing is hilarious to drive at 9 a.m. <laughs> <laughs> Super weird driving <laughs> such an aggressive car while people are waking up, but you know, somebody's gotta do it. It's gonna be us. All right. Hey, did someone say delivery? Last morning, waking up to this, think that this is not really my reality every day, but damn, I'm sure blessed to be able to drive this thing. If someone ever told me, hey, you're just gonna wake up with a Lambo in your driveway in the morning, I'd be like, yeah, can't wait. Not happening, but here we are, guys. Dreams become realities for a weekend anyway. Thank you, Lambo. We'll never forget this weekend. Feel like being that guy who drives a Lambo and some slides. Said to get in this ocean. Things I would not do by myself. <laughs> we do it together. Always better. Thank be goodness better. for this life and this wife. I'll tell you that. That's cute. Successful beach afternoon. Now we unfortunately have to pack up this car. Whatever that means, you can barely get anything into it, but pack up what we can and uh, go back to the city. All the important stuff in the car. <laughs> the arugula. That fresh arugula. Fresh arugula is riding with us. <laughs> Alright, in a weird but 
real turn of events. The Lambo doesn't have a USB port. You gotta buy an adapter for like $300 to get the USB. So my phone died on the way home because I like to use Waze to watch out for all the cops on the road. Couldn't really document the rest of the trip. Got home late, couldn't find parking. Tough to find a garage with insurance that'll take one of these things. I now have to go meet the man to give back the car, which is a sad time for me, but just blessed to have driven that thing. The people even want to let me drive these things. Feel good about it. My brand is going in the right direction. I think the brands can benefit from me using them. I benefit from me using them. I can leverage content to make more interesting things, inspire more people, inspire myself. That's reality. Off to hand off these keys. All right, so in a new reality, these guys are so damn good, they came and grabbed the car before I even got there without the parking ticket, which I think should be wrong. But it went to its home. Anyway, here's one last video of slow-mo me driving, which is what I'll just be thinking about for the next, I don't know, week, maybe two, maybe a month. There you go. Goodbye.